We do have the next person up is one extraordinary activist from Mexico doing incredible work down there, organizing at the grass tops, the grass roots, you name it. Lisa Sanchez, will you please come on up? Thank you, everyone. It's actually a great pleasure to be here. It's not my first conference, but it's definitely the best conference I've been so far. So what I, the first thing I would like to say is I would ask my Latin American fellows to stand up, please. Gente de Latinoamérica, por favor, pónganse de pie. Do you see us? Because we are actually rocking drug policies out of the border of the United States. And we're making a lot of, like putting a lot of effort into changing drug policy in one of the subcontinents that's been more hurt and had suffered the most out of the war on drugs. So I want you to meet all these people and I just want to underline how amazing they've been. All the way from Uruguay, Guatemala, we had a lot of people from Colombia, people from Argentina, and of course people from Mexico. And this is actually the first time that the movement of victims from the war on drugs in Mexico have shown to this conference. So I hope you had the chance to actually talk to them, meeting them, and hear their stories. So I come from one of the countries that had suffered the most out of the war on drugs. In five years, we had over 100,000 people killed, 25,000 people disappeared, they're gone, we don't know where they are. We have lots of children that have lost their parents and that have a very uncertain future right now. We need to end the war on drugs because of those children, because of those mothers that don't know where their kids are. But we also... We also need to end war, the war on drugs because it's a matter of liberties, it's a matter of freedom, but it's also a matter of justice. In our region, in Latin America, we are like the most unequal region in the world. It's a matter of development, it's a matter of, economic, of economics. And what I'm here to say is that you, you guys, people in, the, in, in North America, um, people in Canada, in the US, you've made this possible. Come on, we're in Denver, Colorado, you did it. You smashed it here. So we need you to help us end the war on drugs, not only in Latin America, but also across the world. So I will need your engagement at the international level. I know you're very active at the grassroots level, but we have very important processes coming up. We have the General Assembly of the OAS specializing in drug policy next year. We have the UNGAS. We need you to get involved in such international process and demand your government to actually change its discourse at the federal level and not only at the local level. I will use my last minute to actually thank Ethan and DPA for this incredible effort that you put together. We had interpretation into Spanish. We had a massive delegation of people coming from Latin America, lots of Latin American sessions, lots of international sessions for you guys to actually get to know what's happening in the South, what's happening in other regions. So thank you so much for this effort, Ethan. Thank you so much, Stephanie. The DPA crew, you were amazing. And thank you so much for my, to my Latin Latin American fellows are actually making this change possible so in my home country we don't have to have an organization of victims anymore. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lisa. That was perfect. Thank you.